Good day to each and everyone. So for today, we're going to solve the problem 5.91 in chapter 5 and the 16th edition by Monson. So the problem goes here. A 1,000 meter high waterfall involves steady flow from one large body to another. Determine the temperature rise associated with this flow. So in order to solve this problem, we have to set up the energy equation as P out all over density plus V out squared all over 2 plus G times V out is equal to P in all over density plus V in squared all over 2 plus G times Z in minus uh, U out minus U in minus Q in. So, the term U out minus U in minus Q in stands for the total energy loss in terms of heat, where the U out minus U in is the change of the internal energy of the water flow, and the Q in stands for additional heat transfer rate transferred to or out of the water. Assuming that the static pressure is equal to uh, equal on the top and on the bottom of the water flow the velocities are the same meaning their difference is equal to zero and the additional heat transfer rate is equal to zero the derived equation becomes g times z in minus g times z out is equal to u out minus u in. So next we have g times change of z is equal to u out minus u in. The internal energy according to the thermodynamics can be determined as the product of the temperature in Kelvin and the specific heat capacity of the water which is determined as C is equal to 4,184 joules per kilogram times Kelvin. So therefore, the equation becomes T out minus T in is I no times C V is equal to G times change of Z. Next is change of T is equal to G times change of Z all over C V. So, we, we just have to input the given, those given numbers, which is the 1,000 meter, this 4,184, and the uh, value of this G, which is 9.81 meter per second squared. So, this will become 9.81 meter per second squared times the change of Z which is the 1000 meter all over the value of this which is 4184 joules per kilogram times Kelvin so we just have to calculate that and we'll get 
345 Kelvin and 2345 Kelvin is equal to point to 2.345 C. So the the temperature the temperature rise associated with this flow is 2.345 Celsius. So that will be all. Thank you.